I don't know if I'm okay at all. Like, sometimes I just wish I would just disappear and never come back. But sometimes I want to live and experience life. You know what I realize about life? Not every thought is your thought. Let me explain. I heard it somewhere, but now I honestly believe that it's true. Like, I know for most of us, if you clicked on this video, for most of us, we don't want to wake up mad. Like, we don't want to go through a day mad or sad. You know what I'm saying? And so when I'm thinking that not every thought can be your thought, because not everybody's willing to wake up pissed off, mad, sad, mad at the world. Obviously, circumstances and things that's going on in your life make you regret waking up because I'm like, I got to deal with this shit every day. You know what I'm saying? But I think, realistically, if you had a choice, we would like to wake up relatively peaceful, happy, excited about life. Probably 90% of the world. <clears throat> and I'm not trying to get spiritual. I'm not trying to get, like, like, religious and stuff like that. But I feel like the opposition of life, like God and all things good, then there's opposition to that. Like, everything that's good has to be bad. Rain has uh, the sun. I mean, the moon has the sun. All that stuff has, you know, all that. So it means that to believe that for every happy thought, there's a negative thought. And that the constant battle in my mental and the constant battle for most people in their mental is the fact that they have to choose, actively choose the positive thoughts that come through their head. Right? Because you have all the, the tools mentally to have a good day. Right? The dopamine, the endorphins, all these things that contribute for you chemically to have a happy life. And you think that your brain will choose that most of the time. But I understand that the brain is built to help you survive life, not to be happy with life, right? It's built for you to help you survive the trials and tribulations that life provides, right? And so it's like a negative, but it's not a negative in the sense of like, like, oh man, like I gotta be dread. But it seems like more people in this world are sadder, not happy with what's going on in life, right? Obviously because the rent's high, and nobody want to get paid and everybody in the dating world is half in half out so it's like you like a lot of people are all alone and shit a lot of people say i'd rather just check out life completely and do this life thing by myself struggling so i understand that but it's like if you could find a level of this actively mentally choosing happiness every day then i feel like your life would be a little bit better and i don't know for real honestly i don't know you know what i'm saying like what's going on in your life or what you're battling through. I know for me, I have my own issues. I depression, anxiety, all the things that everybody goes through. I want to say depression. I just be real sad sometimes. But I feel like if I every day if I just wake up every morning, I just choose happiness. Right? Cause I feel like a lot of these things are mental, right? Like a lot of things that's happening in life is more mental than the actual thing that's going on in life, right? Because usually if you think about it, if you survive this long, that mean every issue and problem you've had, you have overcame. Whether that be a breakup, whether that be losing a job, whether that be just things in general. But we don't think about it once we got out of it, you know what I'm saying? We just move on to the next problem. But I realize, regardless of how life is, you're going to always have problems, right? You're going to always have inconveniences. You're going to always have issues that goes on in life. That's kind of how life works. It just depends on the level of inconvenience or the level of problems. Right. And how long is it going to take to fix it or get over it? Whatever the case may be, depending on the situation. And I feel like nowadays. It's getting harder to deal with problems because of the how much things are hitting people at one time, being that being low paying jobs, relationships, future, all that things. It's like it's kind of hard to really go after things that you want to do when you're just trying to survive every day. And so I'm not here to give you advice or tell you what to do. I'm just saying here that I understand and I'm standing with you, right? Because I'm going through the same shit and it sucks. So if I can leave you with anything, just choose happiness every day. Whether that be just being happy that you woke up this morning. Be that I go get you, you know, I get to go get that little coffee before I start my day. Whatever you start your day, just choose happiness today. And hopefully uh, by doing that every day. Regardless of how it looks, you find happiness. So, I don't know if that helps. But that's just kind of what I'm thinking. And, yeah. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.